For me, it was big. Uh, 7.53. Coming up, uh, and here's, uh, Andrew, how I want to give away these uh, Tracy Morgan tickets. Tonight, Tracy Morgan is at the Turning Stone Resort and Casino. And uh, I have, these are uh, balcony table seats. So they're nice seats. Any in, in the showroom there, any seat is a, is a good seat. So, Andrew, are you listening to me? Are you with me? Here's what I want to do. I, I, I don't want to give tickets away to people that are not going to use them. And, I, and I'm not being critical. I'm just saying nothing bothers don't, me more than when I, when I give away my Comets tickets. And I, because you realize that when now when you give away your tickets, it's all done uh, via email. You get a notification the next day from the Comets that say, oh, by the way, your tickets weren't used last night. Mm-hmm. And I hate giving them away when they're not used. So, um, and, and because I would like it to go to somebody who really would like to see this show, Tracy Morgan. Not everybody's a Tracy Morgan fan. It's interesting. Uh, they're, they're pink tickets? They're pink tickets. Well, I don't know. I just bought them through Ticketmaster. Um, so, I, if no. somebody wants these tickets and they would use them tonight, I have two. They're good seats for the show, which is an 8 o'clock show. Just call Andrew and then have him come on the air and tell me, convince me that they're going to go and that they really like the tickets and I'll give them the tickets. Okay. No big contest, no question. Although that, that stinking Beatles question was a good one. It was a good one. Top five songs in 1964. Was your vote no on that to give it to him? He shouldn't have gotten the money, but it would be yeah. nice. It's nice Sorry. to give it away. I, I just thought he's a nice guy. Yeah, Jay, I guess so. West Winfield. I think anyway, we think we don't know. <clears throat> I think him, he but. is. Uh, here's uh, and I've got uh, actually, I have coming, um, uh, uh, Tim has a question here. He said, little known fact, even though the Let It Be album was released after Abbey Road, Abbey Road was their last studio work, and the last words on the last track of the last album were, anybody? Let you it guys be. want to know. And in the end, uh-huh. I didn't know it either. And in the end, the love you take is equal to the love you make. Um, what a show last night at the, uh, at the Stanley Theater. Um, speaking of music, as long as we're on this music run, what's up, Andrew? That, uh, that l- lyric you just used yeah. is part of one of my favorite SNL bits ever when Chris Farley did the Chris Farley show and he had on Sir Paul McCartney and he, mm, you know yes. he, he was just the whole the whole bit was he was an interviewer but he was terrible at it so yeah. he was like you remember that you, I do remember you, that you, <laughs> you remember that time yeah. you said oh, yeah, that was great the love you make yeah. is equal to the love you take yes yes I do awesome. remember <laughs> that was awesome yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah that was a great uh, bit. Um, this Do you kid. remember that time you were that you were with awesome. the Beatles? Yeah, yeah, that was cool. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this kid last night, uh, Ryan Quinn, um, has just knocked it out of the park on uh, NBC's The Voice last night. Really, really good. Uh, anyway, uh, it's on The Voice, so you're expecting probably to see a lot more of him as uh, as time goes on. He's from Westmoreland. We'll be talking to him uh, coming up down the road later on this morning. Big day today for the uh, for Oneida County, right? The state of the county. Tony Pacenti gives his address. And what are we hearing about it in, in, in advance? Are we hearing anything right now in advance? Heard some sparks, right? Some sparks are some we hearing? Some sparks. All right. Uh, so a big state of the county. And Jim Rondinelli will be checking in with him, who will be at the address uh, this morning, which I think will go off at about 8.30. We'll speak with Jim right afterwards and, uh, and talk about that coming up uh, here this morning. Hold on. We got somebody. Uh, Ray. Uh, Ray, are you interested in those tickets? Oh, yeah. Uh, it's, I'll use them. It's Tracy Morgan. You will use the tickets. I know yep, you'll use them. They won't go to waste. Uh, and Ray, by the way, is always somebody. I think you gave Stefan a ride the other day, right? Yep. Okay. <laughs> All, right. All right. Sit tight. We're going to take care of you. Hold on.